Hi, welcome back to Creating with Miss Dovis. We're gonna use the art principle emphasis to highlight a cube that we've made. The internet has lots of different cube directions or patterns that you can print and use. For materials, you'll need paper, pencil, ruler, glue stick, and some colorants like markers. First step is going to be creating your cube pattern, whether you're tracing it or you're drawing it. Next, don't forget to uh, draw in where the folds are gonna be, even the folds for the flaps. Those flaps are so important, please don't forget. Next, you might wanna just make note of what side will fold to what side for your cube when you're done. This will help you kind of organize your doodles. Next, go ahead and start working on your designs. And remember for emphasis, uh, you want to draw something that stands out, that catches the viewer's attention, something that doesn't necessarily belong. Uh, maybe it's that orange and that target, or maybe in a row of green little doodads, you have a violet or a maroon. Maybe it's a heart and a tree. So just take a few minutes and draw different ideas on your template that features something out of the ordinary. It gets your viewer to look at it. that contrast is also a way to create emphasis. High contrast, black and white, um, gray tones, and then color are great ways to draw attention to something. When you're satisfied with your drawing, go ahead and grab your scissors and let's begin putting your cube together. Carefully cut on the lines. Do not cut your flaps off. Be very careful with your flaps. And then go ahead and start folding all the places where you need it folded. Each flap, each side, and when you've got them all folded, kind of start working it together so you can see what side each flap will connect to before you get your glue out. And when you kind of have that figured out, then you'll grab your glue kind of have an idea before. When you feel good about it, grab that glue, put that glue on each of your flaps. I like the purple glue because I can tell when it starts to dry. Whatever glue you have, it doesn't even have to be stick glue, it can be uh, straight up Elmer's. and then just start sticking it to the sides where they would join. Glue 
great job. Hope you like your cube. I hope you uh, had fun. Maybe you'll try another one now that you kind of have the feel for it. But thank you very much for participating with me today. And I hope you have a wonderful day. Take care. Bye.